you already know Natalie. She's in the back of the of this room, but uh, she's actually the secretary for our national committee. I'm now at this moment uh, the chair of, of the national committee. So um, uh, it's an honor for us to have the AC here in Brussels, and of course, uh, I hope that we will have a fantastic seminar because this is this is all about a, a seminar uh, we are arranging. Uh, so I'm glad for the support of the EC, of course, and uh, of, of uh, the president uh, in particularly because there uh, was a, a, yeah, something to do about, about convincing people to do this because it's, it's a challenge, but I'm happy for that. And it's also in the title of the seminar. So, okay, in short, this is the official program. I hope that it is not changing again. <laughs> so um, we had some issues with the agenda of the minister, but uh, they told me that that is quite normal. Um, but I had to change um, in, into the program, but it is not uh, really a, a problem. It's a challenge, you know. So uh, this is the two days program. Uh, we have also a one days pro program, but the one day, one days program will only be there on Friday. So on Saturday we will be one big happy family and run into the same uh, program. So if you take a look quickly, uh, we have Ivana from the R Commission who is uh, doing her thing about um, robots, robots and, and the assistance of robots and disasters. We have a presentation of virtual reality training uh, from XV, XVR, XVR. That's one of our sponsors also. Uh, we have uh, Mark Bogdan from the Netherlands, uh, also about drones and firefighting, but more general uh, from the Netherlands. So we have also a presentation of uh, the electrical fire truck of Rosenbauer. Uh, this is also one of our sponsors. Uh, normally we should have a fire truck here in front of the hotel, but there were some problems, technical problems, so he uh, comes to uh, present it to us all. Uh, we have um, the CEO, if I can, can name him, uh, I can, can uh, tell it like this, I don't know, but we have the CEO of the fuel cell and hydrogen joint undertaking, that is uh, for uh, the European Commission, uh, about Bibark. Um, he is coming to tell us about hydrogen in Europe and the developments. Uh, we all, all, we are as a commission also very in very close contact because we are a member of the European Hydrogen Safety Panel. Uh, I'm there for CTIF, so uh, it's it's a very very important part. Uh, then we have uh, the return of experience, so maybe we uh, will we'll explain. Uh, our objective about that, but it's uh, uh, on the fire that occurred here in, in Brussels, in Brussels, uh, on an energy storage system. So it's very interesting. Uh, uh, we also have uh, the retex about the LNG uh, truck. It's also a fire that occurred in Antwerp, uh, in Belgium. Uh, a whole uh, document about that, and uh, the, it will be the fire commander and the <coughs> chemical uh, chemical advisor that are going to present what they did uh, to cope with this uh, kind of incident. This is this is day one on Friday. So next we have Saturday. We begin the day with. Uh, the presentation of uh, the ISO project, the ISO project with the symbols, and it will be Kurt and not myself presenting uh, the results. Uh, and then, um, yeah, some, something uh, rather special will happen. We have normally uh, the Minister of uh, Security and the Interior who is coming to uh, do a, a speech about, about this. Um, yeah, uh, this event and and, uh, and, and yeah, expressing his support to, to CTF and to the Center of Expertise of uh, for the Federal Sec um, Center of Expertise, um, followed by a signing ceremony. But I'm not sure who is going to be uh, present. Uh, 
But the, 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 the most important thing, and I will continue after this uh, presentation of the program, is that, that CDRF and the minister, uh, those both parties are very important uh, to sign this memorandum of understanding. And I already have now at this moment the, the uh, four, uh, three of four transport um, uh, sector CEOs uh, have already signed this, this memorandum. I'm waiting for one more, it will come probably today. And then we have the, the whole Belgian transport sector who is going to agree using these symbols on their buses and coaches. Excellent. So that's all about uh, the memorandum of understanding. I will show it uh, in, in a while. Uh, then we have uh, the CEO of um, Euro NCAP, who is coming to explain how they are going to implement everything we are, we are doing in the Commission for Excitation and New Technology. Uh, not only symbols, but also the use of the standardized emergency response guide, uh, and also the, the, oh, the lines, but it's not really on that, but the, the use of um, the rescue sheets will be in the safety rating process of Euro so if a new car comes on the market, they will check if this rescue sheet is there, if they are following the standard, the ISO standard, and then they will give a brand, a sort of yeah, tertiary safety rating star. Um, okay, we proceed in the afternoon uh, with uh, presentation, two presentations of the Hazmat Commission. Uh, Nigel and Roman uh, will uh, do their thing about batteries and also have the developments in hazardous uh, materials. Uh, and then we close the, the, the seminar with uh, the last presentations about firefighters health and that will be Tommy uh, from Denmark and that, that's also a very, very interesting uh, presentation. So this will be uh, the program. For the, I'm not going to show you the program for, for the one day on Friday. There are some yeah, changes because we are working in separate rooms, but you will see uh, we try to organize that, uh, uh, that it uh, will go smoothly and, and normally there will, will not, not be a problem. So uh, just because I have to go to my meeting also, just to show you what I have done for the memorandum of understanding. I made the document. Um, we also um, invited press uh, yeah. uh, to the Belgian uh, press, uh, how do you say that? You are Belga, it's a, like a, a bureau. Association. Yeah, it's like a bureau that is responsible, responsible for federal press releases. So we launched uh, um, yeah, a memo, uh, so it's possible that, that they will jump on it. I don't know. Um, we'll see. So, but that's covered by the Ministry of Interior and the Communication Service. And now I'm just... Uh, I'm just searching for the right document. Only it should be this. So we have, yeah, okay. Huh? <laughs> the format. Uh, let's see, yeah, there are all the partners in different transport uh, educational federations. Yeah, of course, it's mentioned it's the Federal Center of Expertise, the Belgian public transport sector, uh, the Belgian Federation of Bus and Coach Operators. That's not public transport, but it's uh, transport, transport. Uh, uh, in general, with buses and with coaches, coaches, and then uh, CCRF. We we cover some topics, and it's in general, so we can uh, do whatever we want with it. It's it's very large, eh? but it has to be like that. So we request the symbols in the rescue sheets and the <coughs> emergency response guide according to the ISO standard. That's the first thing we are going to do, and it's important. It's mentioned in the purchase, purchasing purchasing process, so if they uh, are having new buses that come, come down on the road, <coughs> it will be in their process to, to, to buy, uh, so, so it will be integrated in the whole dossier. 
that that's, that's very important. Um, we are going to use and maintain, maintain the symbols on the vehicles, of course. The rescue sheet, close cooperation in emergency procedures, so for training, for procedures, very important. Uh, share information uh, to organize trainings for first and second responders, but also for their own personnel. So there will be a, an exchange of, of knowledge. Um, and then uh, we are going to install a task force uh, together uh, on the implementation of all, all above mentioned uh, uh, issue or, and principles. So this is, this is the content of this memorandum. And these are, yeah, the... <laughs> the almost filled <laughs> places where they can put their signature. There's one I'm waiting for. This is for the minister. I could not get his digital signature. I was not <laughs> very, very open uh, for that. But uh, we have this. And then up on the last page, we have um, our president that can sign and me as chairman of the commission. But if you don't want that, I can delete it. And, and, and just add other names. Yeah. So it's up to you, to EC, to decide what is going to happen with this memorandum. Uh, I hope, of course, that our president will sign it uh, <laughs> and that you will approve and support it. Uh, but but that's, that's, uh, yeah, that's the story. So this is in a nutshell, uh, Mr. President. Can you just go back to okay. the first sheet of that? That bit, yeah. the, the, second the second page, page yeah, that uh, bit. Maybe the, crunch, the crunch, the crunch. So effectively, it's 